We did it. That was hard. But we did it. That was a good encounter for us because we it was like a good test of our skill in our metal. Uh, I will take all the composite longbows because they sell for a lot. We already have scale mail. Let's see what these folks have. Hide armor. What is this? Oh, a great sword. Uh, it's not not worth a lot. Dagger, chain, shirt, the armor, and a lot. That was it. Well, we got a little bit, and mostly we got experience. For everyone we killed, we got 18 experience. Let's take a look at our experience here. Um, 2805 out of 5,000. Oh. Oh, I guess it's... Huh. These experience levels are definitely different. <laughs> because I'm pretty sure level 2 in tabletop is 300. And then it does not jump to 5,000. So because there's so many more enemies, and hopefully they increase the number of experience points you get... Um, let us press uh, since we're here and since we're so hurt, let's make camp again. Um, so I guess the experience points are not what they usually are in, uh, in tabletop, which is fine. Okay, sounds good to me. Begin resting. I respect useful books, but who needs shallow stories? Fables about a knight who slew a dragon won't help you. You meet a dragon in real life. Then they'll write books about me, Lindsay the Dragon Slayer. Or no, more like Lindsay, who was not <laughs> afraid to challenge a dragon and get heroically eaten in her prime. Sounds good, huh? So yeah, when you rest, when you camp like this with the actual camping supplies, you get some dialogue, and that's that's cool. That's fun. Ooh, we got a hearty meal that time. Nice. And I think that used a camping supplies? No, it didn't. Oh, this is just rations in case our hunting fails, I think. Um, so I guess we didn't have a whole lot of healing spells left. So Amiri is still kind of hurt. Speed. Hopefully we won't have any big encounters as we continue. Yeah, all the stuff. Oh, we missed this. I will take that scroll. Protection from law. That's what the bard had, a long spear. Okay. All right, so where to next? I guess we can go to the tomb next. I'm pretty sure my wife's gonna be home any moment. I'm surprised she's not home yet. Uh, let's save it on the road. And keep going. Old Oak. I know what's here. But I'm going to pretend I don't. Let's enter. Because it's on the way. It's en route. I'm going to hide. Which, you know, when you're walking around in an unknown area, it's always a good idea to sneak. Sometimes it's a good idea to walk around the periphery, too. Why don't we do that? And I, I keep hitting tab. I hold tab a lot just to see if we can spot anything. Now, of course, um, Valerie has terrible sneaking because of her heavy, heavy armor. Oh, look, there's the thing. Uh, I'm not going to send the whole party to get it. Who is the highest stealth? Halda has a 9. Minus 15. Minus 3. Plus 11. Definitely Lindsay. So Lindsay. And Lindsay was called for. That's right. Go get it. Ooh. Potion of Mage Armor. Protection from Chaos. Little Trinket. Scroll of Enlarged Person. This would be good to cast on a Miri in certain situations, unlike some big battles. I it, po Just like potions, I have a tendency to always forget to use scrolls. I could, in theory, take Valerie's armor off and have her sneak around, but I don't know how they game that, like, the, uh, the time. Oh, this is... I can't get in here. Let's walk this way. A duck. A snake. Let's 
quick save. Oh, it paused. It auto paused. Because I see this. A man eater troll. Now, as you can probably guess, it you know, it doesn't take a lot of meta Pathfinder knowledge to know that a man eater troll is not something a party of second level adventurers can deal with easily. We're going to avoid it. This is a I now, in fairness, I really wish that the game gave you some kind of like like you could do a nature knowledge roll or something to try to see if you know anything about these and kind of gauge how difficult it might be compared with your party, like you could do in tabletop. But um, I'm pretty sure we're supposed to avoid this encounter. Um, but we can avoid it without... We can still explore a little of this map while avoiding it. And we will. Let's explore this periphery now. I'll quick save again. Uh, is that a different troll? I think it's the same one. But you know what? Hold on. Everyone go back. Where we can't see it. Okay. I'm going to leave Valerie behind. In fact, maybe I'll only send Lindsay here to explore. Lindsay shouldn't be able to be seen very easily. I mean, it's pretty far away. We might be out of its vision radius anyway. I just want to be super careful here. And I want to be able to run away if we have to. See, now we can't see it. We're perfectly safe. And here's a body. Question is, can we get to that body while sneaking from the Mandator Troll? Let's quick save it. <laughs> and let's give it a shot. Oh, I should have cast Invisibility. Uh, found a magical light crossbow of some sort. All right, run back. Fantastic. I should have cast Invisibility. I think I have it. Well, I'm not sure. I don't know how these spells work. The alchemy spells... Um, oh, invisibility is one of the spell potion things that she can memorize, but we did not. We, I think we might have some... Yeah, we have a potion to vanish. We probably should have used that. It's a light crossbow plus one. We have identified it. Um, who are we going to give that to? We'll give it to Halda. So that's two to seven damage. Two to nine... Oh, no. Once we give it to her, it'll be two to seven. Because she's tiny. Yeah. I think that's good, though. Because you can carry a heavy crossbow. Which is still better damage. Uh, well, better max damage. Not bad. Pretty good loot. And it's worth a lot, right? Plus one... Things are worth... Yeah, it's worth 600. Not bad. All right, let's get out of here. Uh, at some point... Uh, when we're, there's a big oak tree here we would love to explore, but we, our party can't get past that man-eater troll, and I'm pretty certain we wouldn't be able to kill it. Not at this level with a party of four. A party of four that's not even very, um, strong. Okay, so now let's go to the tomb, towards the ancient tomb. We might want to go back to Oleg's first. Yeah, let, that probably makes sense. Let's go back to Oleg's before we do that. Spend a night there. We'll just go this way. Go to Oleg's. Cool. Right as night falls. Perfect. And we can sell anything we have. We can get a good night's sleep here because we are still hurt. We'll use all our healing spells before we sleep. That's how it works. Okay. Let us press on. And I'm not sure how much gold we have now. We still can't make a, a custom character. That is something I'm going to want to do. So the party that I want to recreate... Um, well, A, the party I want to recreate isn't a party of six. It's a party of five. So we can always have an NPC with us. We'll probably do that just for funsies. What? Oh, that's the dragon. Okay. I was like, what? Yeah, is that dragon not with us? 
I don't know how it works. Why doesn't the dragon follow us? Show me your wares. I don't remember seeing the dragon out there. Uh, we'll sell these composite bows. We'll sell that like crossbow. Uh, offer anything we have, which is just that. I could sell some scrolls. No, they really don't sell for much, and they don't weigh much, so it's probably not worth it. Is that all we have for you? I you know, just get rid of this dagger. We don't need it. This is rope, but I guess rope doesn't count. Yeah, rope, I'm sure, can be used in some... I'll get rid of the hide armor. Let's uh, sort this again. Okay. Uh, yeah, still don't have 2,000. We could buy some other things. We could buy a masterwork, something or other, but most of us have masterwork weapons anyway, or better. So I think we're fine. Uh, the party of five that I have, besides Halda, um, consists of a barbarian, a dwarven barbarian, but that's probably not going to be one that we get until later because Amiri kind of fills that role for us. Uh, we do have, I have a human wizard in the party, um, which we might want earlier. We have a uh, rogue, just a straight rogue, which might be useful. And we have a ranger. We have a ranger in the party. So, um, so it's probably good we didn't make Lindsay a ranger for that reason, because we might just want to make our own ranger. Um, and the ranger, uh, has a wolf companion, although I... I thought you got a wolf com uh, a companion before um, level four, but maybe I could be wrong, or maybe they just changed it for this game. But those are the people. How do I? This is from the ring, right? Or whatever it is, the fairy dragon. That's a fairy dragon. Pretty sure that's a fairy dragon. Okay, and I gotta remember to use this uh, murder pony wand. Okay, we should all be. All right, Mary isn't quite at full hit points, but pretty close. Let's do a full save here. And let's head towards that tomb. Without a doubt. Uh, we have room in our inventory bar. I'm going to put this wand here so I remember to use it. Can't forget I have a wand of magic missile, too. Because if I don't use it, eventually it'll just become not worth very much because magic missile level 1 won't be a powerful enough spell. Oh. Um, yes, bring everybody. We only have four people that we can bring. At least right now. We will be meeting more NPCs. I don't know how many NPCs this game has for us eventually, but, um... Alright, so... We're not going to go to Fangberry Cave yet. We want to wait. I just have some meta knowledge. We're going to want to wait till level 3 to get there. Let's go to the Ancient Tomb, if we can. Um... Yep, keep going this way. Let's go this way. Uh, I kind of want to finish this off. Now let's go down. Uh, okay. Let's make camp. This looks good. Maybe we can get another meal. Hunting took nine hours, jeez. All right, we did not get a hearty meal, unfortunately. No encounters, though. Um, we're not going to Thor uh, Fort Thorn yet. It's already almost nighttime again. Let's try to avoid these enemies this time. I successfully evaded. Oh, so maybe if you successfully evade, you can still fight, but this time get the drop on them. Tempting. Yeah, I want to try it. I know we're about to be at a location, and we might want to be at, like, full health for that location, but I really want to see if we get a surprise around here. I feel like I feel like we should be able to. Okay. Um, I don't know if we do. What is it? A kobold! And a kobold alchemist! Okay. I'm listening charge I am yours to command charge I will not falter what troubles you serves you right all right these guys shouldn't be too hard but there might be more bad guys Blood for 
initiative check. Yeah, so we don't get a surprise round, which is too bad. And their alchemist has really won that initiative check, which is too bad. It's about to throw a bomb at us. There's another kobold back there. Halda. Maybe we can cast sleep over here. Oh. Um, that one's charging. Really want to get rid of that alchemist, though. Hall to daze the alchemist. And what did Hall to do? Nothing. Oh, she just had a bad initiative? No? Just taking her a long time. Oh, I guess she used the uh, Inspire Courage. Okay, so the, cal uh, the alchemist used the mutagen that it has as an alchemist. Um... Do we rage? We don't think we need a rage. I'm going to save it. All right, you're dazing. Lindsay, also fighting the alchemist. And that one... Yeah, I think we're fine. Good. Nice! All right, Valerie, charge at that one. Uh, yeah, charge. This didn't work. Oh, you can't. I must be doing it wrong. Whatever, just attack. Run up and attack. Ouch! Well, it hit itself. Oh, it actually barely hurt us. Well, four damage to Amiri, four to Valerie. Oh, because we we won our saving throws, so it only did half damage to us. That was the breath weapon bomb. Okay. So that's why it didn't damage itself, I think. It is dazed now. Hall to keep dazing it. We need to kill it. Come on. Hold on, are you, uh, you still dazing? Oh, it saved. It's not good. Oops. We did save. And it missed itself, it looks like. Alright, it's okay. Uh, hold on, keep, keep dazing, please. Good. Oh, man, we are missing all over the place. All right, at least we hit it that time. Still alive, though. It's using another breath weapon bomb. All right, at least it can only hit a Miri. Ouch. It's saved. Okay. Now attack this one, Amiri. Oh, you can't charge. Probably because of the terrain you can't charge. All right, now you daze that one. And Lindsay, you just straight up attack this you one. You deserved it. Nice. Excellent. So we lost a bit of hit points there. But nothing too bad. What do we get? Oh, we got a pearl. It only costs it it's only worth one, but we got some gold too. I want a copper ring. Uh, this is just leather armor, spear, light crossbow. Nothing very valuable. We got a little gold. What is this? Let us press on. It's just awesome art, is what it is. And we got some experience. And we also found out that even if you evade and then attack, you don't really get the drop on them. Which is too bad. Definitely too bad. Okay. Keep getting uh, achievement survivor, like 1 out of 100, 2 out of 100, 3 out of 100. I wonder if that's days. It's the 21st of Goran. Oh, let's show location names. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Um, let's look at our journal for a sec, because how many days do we have? 82. So we've been seven and a half days so far. Okay. All right, let's get to this tomb. Continue. Go down. Enter. I might want to heal up here with some spells. I don't think we need to rest. Let us not hesitate. But actually, I wrote it why don't you I cast I. healing? Haldus sleep spells might be more useful. Yeah, on a Miri. Yes, yes. I think we're fine. 
That's enough. Uh, let's do a little quick save action. Oh, and uh, I think my wife is home, so we're going to end it here on a little bit of a cliffhanger. So we have entered this tomb. Who knows what we're going to find here, but this is where we heard that Tartuccio was. So thanks for watching, everybody. I really enjoyed playing with you these past two weeks, and hopefully we'll pick this up. I'm not sure when, but at some point soon. Um, let me know what you think. Leave comments, and uh, I'll, I'll see you later. Bye, everybody.